In this video, we will give you a review of NIT Calicut. This institute has received an impressive rating of 4.1 stars out of 5 from students on Shiksha.com. While the institute shines in placements, faculty and campus life, it still has some catching up to do in terms of infrastructure. What's the inside story? Let's find out. So first, placements. It has been rated 4 stars on Shiksha.com for placements. A total of 197 companies visited the campus in the past year, extending offers to more than 700 students, resulting in over 80% placements. Year on year, indicate a consistent increase in average packages with figures rising from 10.75 LPA in 2021 to 14.36 LPA in 2023. And these figures are comparable to those offered at NIT Raurkela, which is ranked higher in NIRF than Calicut. While more than 90% of students from CSE, EEE and ECE stream secured placements, the placement rate in the biotech failed to cross the 50% mark. Now let's check out what students say about the placements in their reviews on Shiksha.com. One student has written that a minimum of 6.5 CGPA is required to be eligible for placements here. The highest package stood 80 LPA this year in the placements concluded so far. Fang companies visit campus every year. Apart from them, major players like Swiggy, l and and Maruti Suzuki come to the campus for recruitment. However, there seems to be a limited presence of companies for production and biotech stream students. The top roles offered here included software developer, data analyst, graduate engineer trainee, web developer, production engineer, business analyst, and design engineer. Talking about internship, students say it's easy to get internships if one has no backlogs. One can apply for internships from the third semester. Few companies recruit interns based on CGPA. Generally, companies provide a stipend of 20,000 rupees during internships. Faculties advise students to apply for research internships as institute gets support from other NITs and IITs. A total of 10 BTEC specializations are offered here, which requires a minimum of 75% in 10 plus 2 along with the competitive JE main scores. Interestingly, while securing admission in CSE has become more accessible over the years, the competition in the rest of the branches have significantly intensified in 2023 compared to 2022. More number of students are opting for less ranked MNIT Jaipur over NIT Calicut as per the closing cutoff ranks. Scholarships are also available for economically disadvantaged students. Now moving on to infrastructure, it has received the lowest rating of 3.8 stars among all key parameters. Spread over 120 hectares, the campus is established at the foothills of Western Ghats in Kerala. It is far enough from Calicut to be peaceful but close enough for city fun. Calicut Airport is 35 kilometers away and the railway station is at a distance of 25 kilometers. Provision of bus service by the institute is an added advantage. As per the students, classrooms are equipped with projectors and amplifying speakers. The college libraries are open 24-7 including a general library and departmental ones. There is a computer networking center for student use. Though infrastructure and lab equipment are quite old but they still work properly. There are 13 hostels, 10 for boys and 3 for girls. 4 to 5 students are accommodated in one room in the first year. From the second year onwards, 2 students share a room. Internet connectivity was found to be a little problematic in the first year hostels as well as the newly constructed hostels. At times, students have to install their own Wi-Fi boxes as well. The college has had some challenges in dealing with water scarcity due to which the academic calendars have to be altered. In fact, students are asked to go home in the water scarce months and these can vary from one year to another. Each hostel has a separate mess and the mess food is specially good for South Indian cuisine. Canteens were found to be more pricey compared to market rates. A number of sports facilities are available here. The new curriculum includes activities to promote fitness awareness. There's a free healthcare center for students as well. Speaking of faculty, students have given them a rating of 4 stars and shared that faculty members are highly qualified and supportive. They clarified students' doubt both offline and online. Students added that the faculty members treat them like their own children. Some of them teach topics that are out of the box in order to make students conceptually strong. The course curriculum is being upgraded with current technologies. Each branch has specialization courses right from first year instead of common subjects. There are one to two practical subjects every semester. Most of the courses include mini projects which help students in team building. The pass SGPA is 5. College supports students by offering re-exam for students that have failed to pass their exams, saving them from repeating the course. Out of the total students, 50% of them belong to the home state. Locational diversity influences group dynamics among students, while the predominant faculty from the home state at times can create an unspoken language barrier for Hindi-speaking North Indian students. And did you know NITC entered into the area of active research with DRDO way back in 1980? In fact, the number of funded research projects have crossed the mark of 150 over the last five years.
The institute established a technology business incubator to nurture startups. With the institute's TBI support, over 100 companies have been incubated and 70 startups have received funding. Interestingly, it conducts a special entrepreneurship development program for women entrepreneurs every year with major funding from MSME EDI. Institute has set up its Design Innovation Center through an MOU with IISC Bangalore. In fact, NITC has achieved 8th rank in the innovation category of NIRF rankings. Additionally, more than 40 MOUs have been signed by the Institute along with a number of patents registered, further solidifying its position in research and development field. Now to campus life, a number of technical clubs for robotics, coding, artificial intelligence, radio controlled modeling are there to enrich the academic experience. In fact, these clubs receive liberal donations from LMNI and NIT CAA for their development activities. And then there are NCC, NSS, adventure clubs, yoga centers, along with several cultural clubs for the holistic development of students. There are three major most awaited annual events. These events add more flavors to college life. College also hosts inter-NIT sports competition. A lot of seminars and workshops are also organized with national and international organizations to make students industry ready. And finally, the rankings. NIT Calicut comes in the list of top five NITs of India. It has recently regained its 23rd NRA rank after a tide of ups and downs over the years. For more details about it and to check out thousands of courses and college reviews, visit Shiksha.com. And we would like to hear from you. So drop a comment below and don't forget to like and share this video.